Right, hi everyone, uh, it's Matt again, and uh, we've got Abs Blast class today, um, starting in a couple of minutes. So, as normally, uh, I'm just going to give you a couple of minutes uh, just to get some people in the class. And uh, all, I'm, all I'm asking you to do, uh, just make sure you, uh, you've got enough space, you've got an uh, exercise mat and uh, just a bottle of water as well. Yeah, you're probably going to need it. Um, I'm going to explain the session to you in a second, but it's just nice and simple. We've got some uh, core circuits today, including four exercises. I'm going to be working for 30 seconds, minimal rest in between. I'm going to do it three times. Uh, the whole session, including the cool down, probably going to last about between 12 to 15 minutes. Yeah, so nice and short today. Um, hope you're going to get your working hard. And if you're not able to uh, to do this class now, uh, you can watch it later on on the YouTube. Yeah, so all you have to do is go on your um, uh, sport YouTube channel, and uh, you can watch it on there, or you can just watch it on IGTV. Yeah, so just on the Easter uh, on your sport channel. So feel free to give it a go later if you uh, can't make it now. Um, again, feel free to drop any comments uh, whether you like this session or if there's anything that you're not keen on. Um, we've got four exercises today. There won't be any easier options because the exercises are not that intense. Uh, so it's all about just making sure uh, you do the exercise right. If it's not the if it's the first time that you've done it, uh, just take it slow on the first round. Just push a bit harder on the second. Yeah. So all I'm gonna uh, do now, I'm just gonna show you the four exercises we've got today. Uh, then I'm gonna get you going at about a minute. Yeah. So I'm just gonna get you working in a sec. Uh, so we've got first one. We've got crunches uh, with the leg raises. Yeah. So all we're doing on this one is just that position there. Okay, leg sets up, crunch, back down, leg lifts and crunch. Yeah, so you're trying to keep them legs off the floor all the time if you can. That's exercise number one. Second one, we've got bicycle crunches. So again, fast pace on this one and really feeling that core, yeah? So working on your obliques, so the side of your core on there. Uh, number three, go toe touches, so legs on the top as straight well as you can. All I want to do just trying to reach the top, just getting the crunches in as well. So that's exercise number three. And number four, pretty sure everyone has done it before. Just now it's an easy one, just a plank for 30 seconds in a straight position on there, yeah? So in that order, four exercises back to back, I'm gonna get you going this in a 10 seconds, yeah? If you're just joining now, we've got four exercises, circuits today, which we're gonna do three times, 30 seconds effort, Five seconds rest in between just to get you like, set off for the next exercise and a bit of a rest in between the circuits, yeah? So just get yourself ready, make sure you've got enough space. We start with the leg raises with the crunches for 30 seconds, yeah? So this is the first round. Let's get you going there, yeah? Three, two, and one. So what are we doing there? Leg lifts on there, all the way down, back to the top. So when you bring this, your head and your upper body up, just trying to squeeze that core as tight as you can so it should be really filling it and getting them legs high as well and not bouncing off the floor yeah so just keep that intensity medium on this one for the last five four three two and one just five seconds rest get ready for the bicycle crunch you ready let's go so on this one faster pace Working for 30 seconds on this one, yeah? If you're struggling, you can just hold on for two seconds on the floor if you want and go back at it again, yeah? Or just go a bit slower and go with the bigger movements, yeah? Completely up to you. This one, we're just gonna get you working your uh, obliques, yeah? So the side of your core on there. Let's get you moving now. So you can get that pace a bit faster. Five, four, three, two, and one. Five seconds recover. And the next one, exercise number three, gonna have them legs on the top and trying to reach to the top. Yeah, so having more crunches, and again, you might start feeling the top of your thighs, especially after the leg raises. And this one, yeah, so just trying to keep that stretch. You can, if you need to hold it in this position and move it more into smaller movements, that's completely fine. We've got the last few seconds to see if you can give a few reps. Last three, two, and one. And just a quick change to the plank now. So in a plank, on a plank, sorry, uh, you just keep it on a straight line on there. Now it's a straight back. So all I want to do, just making sure you're not lifting your bum up like this. Just keep it as straight as you can. That back and core staying engaged, yeah? So strong shoulders on this one. 
and just keep it up on there for 10 seconds. Then we're just gonna get a quick rest for a drink and go and do it again, yeah? Just hold it there for last few. Easy, four, three, two, and one. Well done. We just get a 25 seconds rest and we're just gonna move to the second round. So exactly the same, four exercises, same timings. We're just trying to get a, get a pace a bit faster on the, on the first three, yeah? The plan is to stay on the same intensity. Uh, not much else we can do on that one, yeah? So let's get ready. We just move to crunches with the leg lifts. Ready? Right, let's go. So up to top, crunch, back down, up to top, crunch, back down. Just keep it on there like this. If you struggle with that exercise, yeah, you can just go with the normal crunch, like I'm doing now, or just the leg lifts. So just that leg raises. But I'm pretty sure everyone should be fine with this one. Take it slower if you start struggling. Take it faster if you find it easy, yeah? Last three, two, and uh, one. Smash it. Moving to the second one. So we've got bicycle, bicycle crunches, yeah? You ready? Right, let's go. So this is the one I find piercing the, the hardest. Again, really gets your top of your thighs as well on there, yeah? So if you've done legs yesterday, if you train legs, or if you went for a run, you're gonna feel that a bit more, yeah? Halfway there. Just keep it nice and tight on that stomach. Rest for two seconds if you need to, if you're struggling, and go back at it again, yeah? Nothing wrong if you just rest for a bit longer. Last three, two, and one. And you're just gonna have them legs on the top, legs in the air, and move to a crunch. Get set ready. Right team, let's go. So, just crunch into the top. Nice and slow down. Drive back up, keep them legs as high as you can. As straight as you can, we're really squeezing that core nice and hard, yeah? Again, as the rounds come up, on the last one, probably gonna find that the hardest round, yeah? Just keep pushing, three, two, and uh, one, nice. Great effort, get yourself set up quickly on the plank, 30 seconds, ready, and we off. So this is a uh, nice and easy one. Just to give you a bit of a rest, really. So again, really good one for your core, for your lower back as well. Just keep it nice and straight if you can. And all we've got, just 10 seconds left, nice and easy. Then we're just gonna rest and get ready for the last round, yeah, for today. As I said, nice and short class today. Just keep it with minimal rest and just make sure you keep it medium to high intensity for today. And um, again, grab a drink if you need one and get yourself ready, last round, so last circuit for today before we move into a quick cool down and stuff, yeah? So, get ready, we've just got a crunch, the leg lifts again, you should know the order now, get yourself set up, ready for a last big push, yeah? Three, be ready, two, and one, let's move it, so up to the top, control the way down, and making sure you're not Bouncing off the flow of them legs, yeah? If you need to reset on the bottom, like I'm doing now, that's completely fine, but try not to, just to make it slightly harder, yeah? Keep pushing there for 10 seconds. Just give me a few more reps, yeah? Oh, it's getting tough now. Last three, two, and one. Perfect. And we'll move to the second one. Bicycle crunch again, yeah? So fast pace, ready. Let's get you going now. So just working the side of your core again, as fast as you can. So you're bringing your right elbow to your left knee, opposite side, and we move in here. So same again, if you start struggling, anytime you start struggling, you can just go with the easy option like I'm doing now. So that's completely fine. Whichever option you feel more comfortable with, just make sure you push it for the last four, three, two, and one. And uh, we should be really feeling that core now working, yeah? So let's just get two exercises out of the way. Legs on the top. And we're just reaching as hard as you can with them crunches, yeah? So we've just got three variations of the crunches today. Nice and simple class. Just four exercises, easy to remember, yeah? Easy to follow, hopefully. 10 seconds left. Keep pushing there, nearly there. And give me last five. Four, three, two, and one. Smash it. 
Get yourself ready, get yourself set up for the last one. This is your last plank of the day. 30 seconds, easy work. Then we're just gonna get you to do a couple of stretches just to finish it off. And our class will be finished yeah, in a couple of minutes. So again, if you manage to get, get through it without any extra rest, smashed it. If you need a bit of extra rest, yeah, it's completely fine as well. Last push now. Stay on that plan for last five, four, three, two, and one. And just grab a quick drink if you need one. And all we're gonna do, just a moment to a nice and easy cool down, just to get that heart rate a bit lower. And just to get you stretched as well, and making sure you not uh, preventing any injuries and making sure you all good to recover. Hold it there. Again, we're going to carry on with the live uh, live classes um, throughout the August. Um, so I hope, I'm hoping everyone's uh, looking forward to going back to the gyms uh, either this weekend or next week. But if you want to join me with the classes in your house as well, or wherever you are, then uh, you're uh, welcome to, yeah? It'd be nice to see you there. Um, as I mentioned before, also you can watch on YouTube, there's a lot of different classes on there as well, which I've delivered over the last couple of months. Um, so if you're struggling with any ideas, anything good to uh, good to uh, good to train, just have a look on there. Yeah, see if there's anything that you you might like. And um, hopefully you did. Yeah. Just keep on that shoulder stretch. So again, just use that little in the plank. So I'm just going to give you a good stretch, a last stretch for today before I get let you go off. Yeah. Again, any comments you might have. Uh, just drop them on there now so I can just have a look, see if you liked it or not. And uh, I'll be seeing you Tuesday, yeah? So Tuesday, half 12, is the HIIT class. It's high, high intensity training with myself uh, on Instagram. Uh, hopefully I'll be seeing you there, yeah? If not, um, I hope everyone has a, has a nice weekend and uh, I'll be seeing you soon, yeah? See you in a bit.